gentlemen, and welcome back to the Monday Night Monster War. We're in week two of the November season, and thank you so much for joining us. I am your host, and it is a pleasure to have you. Folks, if you're new here, hit that like and subscribe button and crush that little notification bell. And as always, we like to start off by recognizing our brave men and women serving in our armed forces, standing guard for our nation. We appreciate you, and we salute you. Folks, Rich Wagner has been on a tear lately, winning 11 out of his last 12 races, and he carries the flag here tonight. He's looking to repeat and keep the flag. Can he do it? 15 other drivers looking to take it from him. This one's brought to you by Jake's Killer Custom Creation. Check him out on Facebook and eBay for all your custom diecast needs. Folks, this is going to be a wild night of racing. Week two of the November season is going to kick off right now. Let's take a look at the bracket and see how it's going to stack up. And then starting us off is going to be Bulldozer taking on Snakebite. Then it's Jester taking on Bad Company. Vendetta takes on Bad Habit. Avenger takes on Mental Health. Latter half of the bracket sees Northern Nightmare taking on Max D. Carolina Crusher taking on Grave Digger the Legend. Bounty Hunter takes on Rage. And Black Pearl takes on the Grave Digger. And up first, John Kadiax in the Bulldozer Machine taking on Kevin McCarthy in the Snake Fight Ford. Both these guys looking to climb up the points ladder this week. John KDX has been impressive. Last couple outings he's been out here, that bulldozer machine has get dialed in. Gavin McCarthy returning to us in week two here in the Snake Bite Machine. And the Monday Night Monster Wars underway. There they go up over the Chris Corpin and Gavin McCarthy in Snake Bite. Gonna get the win as there was trouble for John KDX in the bulldozer. John Kadiak knows it over hard. And there you see the truck is leaning to the driver's side there. Might be some damage up to the front suspension there. But Kevin McCarthy and Snakebite gets the win. And we go down now, MTC track crew and officials. There you see the damage done to that front tire. That front wheel might have messed up the planetary gear. But we'll have to see. John Kadiak's on the trailer. He'll be back next week. And up next, Johnny Retlaw, the bad boy himself, the Spooky Monster Mass champion, taking on Joey Andrews in bad company. The Jester Laid in the far lane, looking bad fast in the Spooky Monster Mash. Got out early last week, looking to redeem himself this week. Joey Andrews looking to turn it back on. He's been having a string of bad luck lately, lately trying to turn it around tonight. Can he do it against the bad boy? Here they go down the ramp. Up over the Chris Car pit, and Joey Andrews gets sideways in the finish. The shutdown area, but he gets the win. Johnny Redlaw came up just short. Just machine wasn't dialed in just the way he wanted it. He's on the trailer tonight. Joey Andrews moving on to round two. Well, let's take a look at the replay now and see how it happened. There you see big horsepower from both trucks as they pop the front, front wheels off the starting gate. And there you see the little bobble from Jester enables Joey Andrews to capitalize. He had a good, clean, smooth pass and gets the window right there. Turns it over on the side in the shutdown area. But a light rollover, no damage. He'll be back for round two. You see they're down there to turn the bad company Chevrolet back over. Joey Andrews, a little bit better start this week. Moving on to round two. And up next, Jason, Sensation Craddock and Vendetta. Taking on Butch Cassidy Jr. in Bad Habit. Jason Craddock has been coming up with some of the best saves you have ever seen out here on the MTC circuit. He can drive the heck out of that Vendetta machine. But Butch Cassidy looking to make a statement here tonight in Bad Habit. Stage ready to go. Vendetta, Bad Habit. Here's the green light. Down the ramp. Up over the crush car pit. Oh, and it's a close one, ladies and gentlemen. Side by side, all the way down, neck and neck. They cross the line at the same time. My goodness. That was so close. We're going to go down to photo finish. And let's take a look here and see. Who gets the win? And it looks awfully close. And folks, the official word is too close to call. They're going to 
free stage and run it again. They call it a draw. Both competitors now up at the starting gate again. Bad habit in the far lane this time. Vendetta in the near lane. Jason Craddock, Butch Cassidy doing it again. Great light. Then they go down the rip. And Jason Craddock gets the win. Looked like something may have let go in the bad habit machine. It's just didn't have it on that second pass. Maybe some fuel issues or maybe the timing was off. Not quite sure what happened, but Jason Craddock picks up the win and moving on to round two. And up next, Devin Treat and Metal Health taking on Jimmy Bones Ferguson in Avenger. Ford versus Chevy here. Devin Treat is becoming one of the most consistent drivers in any diecast circuit anywhere. He's taking on a fan favorite, Jimmy Bones Ferguson in Avenger. Ford versus Chevy, waiting on green. There they go, down the rim, up over the crutch guard pit, and it's close. Jimmy Ferguson was trailing Devin Treat. They hit no man's land, and Jimmy Ferguson was making up some ground. It looks like he may have made the comeback, but let's go to the replay just to make sure that was awfully close. And there we see both drivers get off to a good clean start. A little bobble there for Jimmy Ferguson. He gathers it back up. Up and over the crush car pit. Has a little bit of lead in the air, and he's gonna move past Devin Tree. Boom's gonna get the win in Avenger. Devin Tree out early this week, not the way he wanted to start. But sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. And Jimmy Bones Ferguson moving on. Metal Health on the trailer. He'll be back next week. And up next, Starvin, Corey Marvin in Northern Nightmare. Taking on Chris Walquist in Max D. Their first ever Monday Night Monster War winner, Corey Marvin in the Northern Nightmare. Taking on Chris Walquist in the Max D machine. They are staged, ready to go. Who's going to get the win? Green light, there they go, down the ramp. Up on the crush car pit. Oh, and a well finished there. Both drivers turn it over. Chris Walkers able to keep his foot in it and roll through. My goodness, what a close finish there. I think they collided. I'm not sure what happened. Corey Marvin turns the Northern Nightmare Machine on its side. The big red Ford. Laying on its side, the Max D machine able to put it back down on all fours. Let's take a look at the replay and see who got the win. And there you see, there they go down the ramp. Max D with maybe a slight lead, but here comes Corey Marvin. Huge air for both drivers. Up over the bus stack and right there, Max D rolls to a victory. He puts away Corey Marvin. What a wild ending there, folks. They were side by side. Kind of got crossed up there in the jumps. And they end up colliding into each other. But Robin is racing out here. And Max D moving on to round two. And there you see track crew officials down there now to turn back over the Northern Nightmare Ford. Stopping Corey Marvin. Not the start he wanted tonight, but he'll be back next week. Ready to go. And up next, Steve Bad of the Bone Jones and Carolina Crusher taking on Fish Your Boy Shaggy Matt Cheever and Grave Digger the Legend. Steve Jones did some damage on his normal truck, so he's racing the vintage backup trucks who did well in it last week. Grave Digger the Legend, the Purple People Leader, as everybody's calling it, or AKA Grimace, out here for Matt Cheever. Let's see who's gonna get the win. Steve Jones, Matt Cheever, there they go down the rim. Up over the crush car pit, and Shaggy gonna get the win. Oh my word, what an upset. Unbelievable, Shaggy gets the win over Steve Jones. Not the start Steve Jones wanted this week, but he's on the trailer, Carolina Crusher. Didn't have it together tonight. We know the crew will thrash and have it ready for next week. Matt Cheever moves on. And now, Timothy Cantwell, the cowboy from hell and bounty hunter, taking on Rudy's Elegy in Rage, the hellbilly himself. Folks, this one is going to be a good one. These two veterans are ready to throw it down right here, right now on the MTC circuit. Let's see who's going to get this win between the two veterans. 
And there they go, down the rim. Rudy's eligible to leave, but he rolls it over, and Tim Cantwell tries to save it, but he turns it over. Bounty Hunter upside down as he gets the win. Rudy Zellinger got into trouble. He was able to roll through it. Much like Chris Wolfwest in the Max D machine earlier. But he comes up short against the Bounty Hunter. Timothy Cantwell moving on. And there you see they have the raised machine hooked up. Towing it back to the garage area. They'll thrash and have it ready for next week. And there you see they're flipping over the Bounty Hunter machine. Timothy Cantwell, one bounty collected tonight. Let's see if he can get victory number five. He'll be back for round two. And to close out round one, it's some Savvy Zillagy in the Black Pearl taking on the Phenom, Rich Wagner and Gravedigger. These are two bad, fast drivers out here. Savvy Zillagy rocking the square body Black Pearl Chevrolet this month. And there you see Probably the most famous monster truck, aside from Bigfoot of all time, Gravedigger. Out here on the circuit, Rich Wagner has won 11 out of the last 12. Can he go for number 13? There we go, down the ramp. Up over the crush car, Fitz Savvy with a lead, but Rich Wagner comes back and turns it over. You'll have to forgive my voice, folks, as I have been sick of the dog this entire month from October, still recovering in this month, but Rich Wagner comes back and gets the win over Savvy Zillagy. What an ending there. And there you see the track road officials turning the Gravedigger machine back over. Rich Wagner, the Phenom, defends the flag in round one. Let's see how he'll do it in round two. Speaking of round two, let's take a look at the action. It's Snakebite taking on Bad Company. Vendetta takes on Avenger. Max D takes on Gravedigger the Legend. And Bounty Hunter gets the shot at Gravedigger. And folks, it's Gavin McCarthy taking on Joey Andrews, Snakebite, Bad Company, Ford, Chevrolet. Snakebite out of the Bigfoot camp. Joey Andrews in Bad Company, representing the Botox camp. Who's gonna get the win? Joey Andrews looking to go to semifinals, but so is Gavin McCarthy. There's a green light. Then they go down the ramp, up over the crush car pit, and Gavin McCarthy turns it over, but he gets the win. Joey Andrews comes up just short. He didn't get the round two this week, but he was looking to do better, but could not keep up with the snake bite forward. Let's take a look at the replay and see how it happened. And there you see it down the ramp. About dead even there on the start, up of the crush car pit, and right there, Kevin McCarthy in the air. Gets the win and puts away Joey Andrews in the big bad Chevrolet over there. Turns it over. Luckily, it looks like a light roll over, so shouldn't have too much trouble bringing it back. The semi-final action. Joey Andrews on the trailer. He'll be back next week. Track route official down there now to turn. The snake bite forward back over out of the Bigfoot camp. There you see it, snake bite. Gavin McCarthy going to semifinals. And up next, Mr. Sensational Save himself, Jason Craddock and Vendetta, taking on Jimmy Bone Ferguson in Avenger. These are two MTA veterans out here, two of the best diecast drivers anywhere. They are out here on the MTC circuit, trying to get to semifinals. Stage ready to go. Green light, there they go, down the ramp. Up over the crush car pit, and Jimmy Bones Ferguson may have just made another comeback. Jason Craddock had the lead all the way down, but Jimmy Ferguson was coming back on him in the end. Man, that was close. Bones looks like he has that Avenger Chevrolet dialed in tonight. Let's see, was he fast enough to catch up to Jason Craddock and get the win? There's a green light there, you see them coming down the ramp. Up over the crush car pit slightly to Jason Craddock and right here, Jimmy Ferguson makes up the ground and gets the win! Jimmy Bones Ferguson puts away Jason Craddock. Just barely, but he got it done. He's going to semifinals. Jason Craddock on the trailer. He'll be back next week.
And up next, it's your boy Shaggy, Matt Cheever, and Grave Digger the Legend. Taking on Chris Walkris and Max D. And Shaggy looked unbelievably fast in round one as he put away Steve Jones. Chris Walkris trying to get Max D to semi-final action. Grave Digger the Legend, Max D, stage, ready to go. Green light, there they go. Down the ramp up over the Chris Carpet, and it's a nervous close finish. Both trucks turn it over. And again, folks, forgive my voice for giving out. I'm still bouncing back. But what a finish there. Both drivers turn it upside down, putting on a show for you fans. Could you ask for anything more as a monster truck fan? Let's go down to the replay, see who got the win. And you see there they go, off to a great start side by side. Slightly the Shaggy, did Chris Walkers make the comeback? Oh, he comes up just short. Shaggy hangs on the win, and they both turn it over. Shaggy trying to save it there, but couldn't quite throttle out. What a finish. Awfully close, but Grave Digger the legend gets the win as he turns it on the roof. Shaggy moving on to semifinals. How about that? And here we go now. MTC track route officials down there to turn Grave Digger the Legend over. Shaggy looking bad fast tonight. Moving on to semifinal action. And there you see the Max D machine getting flipped over. He'll be back next week. But Shaggy moving on to semifinals in Grave Digger the Legend. To close out round two, Rich Wagner the Phenom in Grave Digger. Take it on, Tim Cantwell in Bounty Hunter. Folks, what can you say about this matchup? Rich Wagner and Timothy Cantwell, two of the fastest diecast drivers anywhere. Team MTA in a friendly competition here. They're rooting each other on, but they're also not going to cut each other any slack. Who's moving on to semifinal action? Showdown between the two veterans, two fan favorites. Stage, ready to go. Grave Digger, Bounty Hunter. Green light, there they go. Down the ramp up on the Chris Carpet. And trouble for Bounty Hunter. And Rich Wagner going to get the win. Oh, my goodness. And once again, problem for Timothy Cantwell. He was able to save it. It's like I said, he is one of the best diecast drivers anywhere. The seasoned veteran knows how to get it done. But ran into trouble at the jumps. He got crossed up and Rich Wagner took advantage. Let's take a look at the replay, show you how it happened. Good clean start for both drivers. Up over the crush car pit right there. Watch Timothy Cantwell right there gets crossed up. And that enables Rich Wagner to snag the win and keep the flag. Good save by Rich Wagner in the end. Folks, unbelievable run by Timothy Cantwell, but he comes up short tonight. Folks, the semifinals are next. Stick around. We'll be right back. Action. Snake Bite takes on Avenger. Grave Digger the Legend takes on Grave Digger. And up next, Jimmy Bones Ferguson and Avenger taking on Gavin McCarthy and Snake Bite. Jimmy Ferguson looking to get to the finals and make 
his run at a second Monday Night Monster World Championship win. Kevin McCarthy and Snake Fight from Cardiff Wells across the pond looking for his first Monday Night Monster World Championship. Let's see who's going to the finals. Avenger, Snake Fight, classic mashup. There they go down the ramp. Up on the crutch goes Avenger with the lead, but Kevin McCarthy comes back to win a save at the end as Jimmy Bones Ferguson rolls Avenger over. What a finish. Oh my goodness. Ford and Chevrolet match up there and Ford comes out on top. Jimmy Ferguson, what a run he had tonight getting all the way to the semifinals. Comes up just short against Gavin McCarthy in Snake Fight. Going to the finals for the first time in MTC. And up next, it's your boy Shaggy Matt Cheever, Grave Digger the Legend. Taking on the Phenom, Rich Wagner and Grave Digger. Interesting matchup here, folks. These are two veterans. Shaggy, always a fan favorite, always puts on a show. Just drives and puts his foot to the floor and hangs on. Rich Wagner, the calculated veteran, knows how to get the win. He's been on a hot streak lately. Can he keep it up? There's a green light down the ramp up on the crush car pit and trouble for Shaggy as Rich Wagner gets the win. Going back to the finals. Shaggy put too much throttle in it and caused a wheel stand. And now the name of Rich Wagner to get the win. Let's see. Go back down to the replay. As Rich Wagner keeps the flag and heads to the finals. Here's how it happened. There you see both drivers get off to a good clean start. Down the ramp they go side by side. And right there, Rich Wagner makes up a little ground. And there's the wheel stand from Shaggy. And that cost him the win. Rich Wagner. Moving on to the finals to defend the flag. Unbelievable. How about that, folks? Rich Wagner's streak continues. And this might be trouble for the MTC roster. Rich Wagner is a 16-time MTA champion. And he's looking to make his mark here in the MTC circuit. But folks, here's your finals. It's Kevin McCarthy and Snake Bite taking on Rich Wagner and Gravedigger in the final shootout here to see who's gonna come away with the Monday Night Monster War Championship win of week two of the November season. Folks, stick around, finals coming at you right after the break. Don't go anywhere, we'll be right back. Well, folks, if you like diecast monster truck action, then make sure you head on over to Monster Truck Attitude and check out their action there. You can even register to enter one of their races. That is Monster Truck Attitude over there on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. Make sure you like and subscribe and show them some support as they are the granddaddy of them all when it comes to diecast monster truck racing. That is Monster Truck Attitude on Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, and TikTok. Make sure you check them out and enjoy the show over there. And it's final time, ladies and gentlemen, Gavin McCarthy in the Snake Fight Ford taking on Rich Wagner, the Phenom, in Gravedigger. And there you see him stage getting ready. Gavin McCarthy bringing the Snake Fight Ford to the starting gate. Hungry for his first Monday Night Monster War Championship win. Snake Fight running bad fast out here tonight. But here comes the Phenom, Rich Wagner, who is on an absolute tear. He seems unstoppable right now. And Gravedigger, can he defend the flag and pick up his third Monday Night Monster War win? Or will Snake Fight pull the upset? Kevin McCarthy, Snake Fight. Rich Wagner in the Gravedigger. This is it, folks, final time. Will Kevin McCarthy get his first Monday Night Monster War Championship win or will Rich Wagner, hang on to the flag. Wait down green. It's showtime. There they go. Down the ramp up on the Chris Carpet. And Rich Wagner gets the win. They both roll it over. 
Bubba and Rich Wagner able to save it. Unbelievable. Rich Wagner gets the win and defends the flag going back to back in week one and week two. Unbelievable. What a run by Kevin McCarthy tonight. Hats off to him. But he fell victim to Rich Wagner. Let's take a look and see how it happened. There you see down the ramp they go, side by side. Up over the crush car pit, huge Aaron right there. Rich Wagner gets the win and passes Kevin McCarthy. He came up just short tonight. What a run from Kevin McCarthy. He's got to be pleased with that, but we know he wanted the win. He'll be back next week ready to go, but Rich Wagner hangs on to the flag and goes back to back. Unbelievable, folks. So ladies and gentlemen, please help me in congratulating. Going back to back, Rich Wagner and Grave Digger! And here we go, folks. Let's take a look at the point standing. Rich Wagner and the Phenom. Unbelievable. Back-to-back -back wins. Holding the commanding lead right now with 120 points. But it's only week two, folks. we got three weeks left in the season, so it's still anybody's ball game. Holding the spots below him are Devin Treat and Matt Cheever and Gavin McCarthy with his performance tonight at fifth, all with 50 points. And then Steve Jones, Butch Cassidy Jr., Timothy Cantwell, Jimmy Ferguson, all of 40. Savvy Zillagy, Corey Marvin, Joey Andrews, Jason Craddock, and Chris Walcris, all with 30 in the bottom of the pack. John Kadiex, Rudy Zillagy, and Johnny Redlaw, all with 20. Folks, it's early yet. Still anybody's ball game. But Rich Wagner continues his reign over the point standing as he de successfully defended the flag tonight, picking up a back-to-back. -back Monday Night Monster War Championship win. Well, folks, thank you so much for joining us. We're so glad that you stopped by. Thank you for everyone who got involved in the live chat. Thank you for everyone who commented on the video, who liked, subscribed, all that stuff. We appreciate it greatly as it helps the channel and it'll help us bring you more Diecast Monster Truck Racing action. And if you did enjoy the show, folks, please do not forget to hit that like button. It would mean a lot to the channel and I sure would appreciate it. And folks, if you like Diecast Monster Truck action, don't forget to check out our friends over at Midwest Madness. Some of the best racing that you'll see the Diecast Monster Truck Circuit anywhere. They throw down once a month. So be on the lookout for them. Check them out on the Midwest Madness YouTube channel. And also, you can't forget about the granddaddy of the ball, the big show, the big time, Monster Truck Attitude. They are the best in the business at Diecast Monster Truck Racing. And they throw down each and every week with one big event at the end of the month. So don't forget to check out Monster Truck Attitude, the absolute hands down best diecast monster truck racing channel on YouTube. Folks, folks, I've been your host. It's been a pleasure. We hope to see you back next week right here on the Monster Truck Championship Diecast YouTube channel for week three of the Monday Night Monster War. Take care, everybody. We'll see you next week.